Hi, this is Joe from ProtoDojo.com. And a few weeks ago, I was inspired by other projects on the internet to build your own Steadicam Merlin. If you're not familiar with that, it's a product for about $800 from Steadicam that allows you to balance your camera on top and to get you smooth, fluid shots while you're filming. Now, unlike the other projects, I only have this flip minnow, and I wanted to construct a smaller package that I could throw in my backpack when I go hiking. Now, I'm going to talk about overall construction of the device, then show some close-ups, and then finish with some footage from a hike at Echo Mountain last weekend. If you want to skip me talking, just go to the end of the video. Anyway, so let me start off with the handle. The handle is a flashlight. It's a $9 flashlight from a local hardware store, and in the head is a ball bearing. The ball bearing allows you smooth, smooth fluid rotation of the, of the handle, and when in conjunction with this U-joint from an RC boat, you get real fluid movement in the handle on the bottom. Overall construction is from raw aluminum that I bent and drilled holes and attached together with screws. You can see the top has a channel that allows the camera to move forward and back, as well as the base has an adjustable weight that moves, that swings left or right. Now that's key to stop um, the apparatus from balancing in these directions. I'm um, just using normal washers as weight. Uh, the last keynote is since the flip camera is so light, it's very difficult to balance the whole apparatus. So what I did is add additional weight at the top here. So what you can see is, is when balanced, the camera still is relatively flat. And no matter my hand movement, the camera stays relatively flat. You know, no matter how I move the camera, it stays relatively flat. Now you can see how the camera moves side to side. And so the way you operate the apparatus is you put all the weight on this hand here. And you just use your two fingers to control just the top. And that controls left and right movement. And see, that's where that ball bearing comes in place. You can see how smooth this movement is right there. And so when you move these two in conjunction, that's how you get your movements here. Uh, and so it works quite well, and um, you can go to my website for the Google SketchUp design docs that I use if you want to build your own. Um, and uh, thanks for watching. Three years ago at the old casino, during an incredible night that lasted until 6 in the morning, a young guitar player appeared as a surprise guest. He got an absolutely gigantic triumph, and we are very proud to welcome him back tonight with this group.